Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Albion. Let's make our way back to the north. Back through the uh, canyon. Syra has most of her spell points left, so that's pretty good. Malthus is all of his, so he will be useful against any of the bandits that we uh, face up here. All right, let's get going. So, like I said, there's a limited number, but I do not know how many. There we go. There's another one. All right, so we've got uh, a Bandit 1, a Bandit 2. Let's go ahead and advance the party. I'm pretty sure it's the Bandit 3s that have the magic. I would kind of like to save my um, my MP for that one. My spell points. There we go. He's dead. Knew I shouldn't have attacked with uh, arranged people. There we go, and you're dead. 45 experience points. Five for you, and... Five for you. Uh, that is a regular bow. So that is going to be better for you. Go ahead and give this to uh, Drew. How much can you carry? Not that much more. But you're almost full up on uh, inventory space anyway. Alright, so... Uh, let's see... The food situation... Everyone has some... Uh, has the same amount, it looks like. So just uh, hand this out this way. There we go. And I really should have saved it. Alright, it's just a couple Bandit 1s and a Bandit 2. Let them advance. Go ahead and attack you. Go ahead and attack you. You go ahead and attack him. And Melthus, you go ahead and attack him. The guy back there has a bow. Rude. All right, let's go ahead and advance the party. Move over there. Attack. Attack. Attack, and let's have you use a small fireball. You can use a lot of those. Tom is not looking too good right now. And another fireball. 65 experience points, and Melthus has reached level 8. So, they do actually use up the uh, the arrows that they have. Which is interesting. Take two. Take one. I don't actually know if everyone has to have uh, food or not. All right, you can carry a little bit more. Nope, not that. All right, what about one of these? Nope. Nope. 
All right. Tom is uh, overloaded. Uh, you can carry. You can actually carry quite a bit more. Rainer is stronger than Drear, and that is kind of weird. There we go. Uh, let's go ahead and take a quick save. Right there. That is fine. And use some magic. Do a little bit of healing on Tom, please. That is not a whole lot. little bit if it gets if he takes another blow in combat I'll use like a stim drink or a potion or something the sound effects for the wind is really loud music what music I can't hear the music Okay, well, the good news is that we're out. The bad news... Oh, no, I guess we're not out yet. Well, unfortunately, I did not end up uh, using any of Sira's magic. I didn't use up enough of my own. Uh, I mean, Malthus's as well. Hello. I would like to sell you some things. Okay, 7.2 coins for the uh, two meats. Nope. The ladle can be sold for 7.2 coins. Valuable, valuable uh, um, ladles. Sell the Crondir gem thingies. The Warniac spheres, 27 coins. Alright, uh, you do have boots, so I can sell you that. 5.7, that's fine. Small leather shields. Yeah, that's a good, uh, good price. Yeah, Gikas Mage can uh, use that. Alright, sword and short sword. How much does a bow go for? 33. That might be worth it, but I might want to sell it to the... Uh, this one else. Let's see. So that's 45. That's 46. That's 12. All right, I'm not going to sell the short swords yet. Sell the uh, the swords, the armor. All right, 12 for that. Let's get those together. Uh Tom, clothes, 2.6. Uh, no, I don't want to sell that yet. Give that over to... Can I not... I can't give that to Drear? Alright, let's sell all of the... Uh, things that she already has... How much do the shoes go for? 1.2. Alright, so I do not want to sell the shoes to her. She does not have those, so... Hmm... 
Yeah, this is so much nicer than games where it's like, oh yeah, you uh, you picked up all of the uh, the short swords and the long swords and uh, everything that the uh, enemies had. Uh, you get two gold. There you go. Two uh, two whole whole gold pieces. What? You want more than that? Too bad. That's not treasure. That's junk. All right, I'm definitely getting uh, a solid amount of cash. Uh, so 12.5 for those. 12.5 for those. Large dagger, 3.6. Okay, leather vest. Sell these boots. Those boots were made for selling. Alright, I think I'll double check the price of those uh, elsewhere. That's, that's a lot. What, uh... Was it nine damage? Okay. I don't think you had anything. And you have that stuff. Alright, I got over a thousand. It has been nice talking to you. Make our way over to the uh, the weapon shop. Because if he has some of these items, I might just sell them to him, even if it's a little bit lower. I don't know if there's... Uh... Uh, show us your selection of weapons. Alright, he does not have a regular bow. He would sell... He would buy that for 26. These were, what, 12.5? 10. You know what? That's a pretty big difference. However, I am going to sell the clothes here. Two coins for that. I will sell the uh, shoes. One coin. Uh, Malthus' old large dagger. 2.9. And I think I'll sell these other items to Winian because it's just... I'll, I'll get so much more out of it. Uh, farewell. I might have gotten better prices for some of those things down at uh, the south, but it's fine. Hello, I'm back. Uh, yes, I would like to see your wares and sell you some uh, things. Yeah, I mean, 12, getting an extra 2.5 gold out of each of these, it's pretty good. And I will sell her the bow. No, I won't, actually. Because it's just one, whereas... Uh, Like, I'm getting... I'm selling a bunch of these. So they'll all stack up nicely. Worst case scenario, I'll buy, like, his Warniac Spheres or his... Uh, or her... The Warniac Sphere, the Lockpicks or something like that. Um, maybe even the pieces of meat. I mean, I'll be losing some money overall, but... If it lets me sell things to her that she wouldn't otherwise have... 
I think that's worth it. Yeah, so essentially I got um, an extra 25 gold out of that. That's nothing to sneeze at. On top of that, um, you know, I mean, like, I, I kind of sold like almost like an extra one that way. Compare, you know, price-wise. Alright, let's go ahead and save before we head back in. Because we've got some money now, and uh, we definitely want to... ...buy a few things down there. Suddenly, several shabby, mean-looking persons jump out of a hiding place. Alright, so we got uh, two a Bandit 2s, a Bandit 1, and a Bandit 1. Go ahead and attack. I'll go ahead and wait with the rest of you. Use magic. Go with a Frost Avalanche. Excellent, I can advance next round. Eighteen damage. That is a pretty nice. Advance the party. Go ahead and attack. Actually, uh, do nothing. Advance party. They're still frozen, which is really nice. Bow is broken. Oh my. That is unfortunate. It's weird that I don't get a bow from these guys, though. They have arrows, but I don't get their bows. Yeah, I'm going to want to repair that. Whose was that? That was Sira's. Okay. Also, food-wise, everyone appears to have the same amount. Alright, let's just give it all to you for now. I do wish that there was a, a take-all option, but uh, we do not have that. Let's go get that bow repaired. Uh, yes, can you repair this? have to talk as the person, apparently. Thirty-two coins. That is unfortunate, but it is worth it. Okay.
All right, can I rest? Uh, yes, let's go ahead and rest. Get healed, get some uh, hit points back. Uh, get some spell points back, I mean. Okay, before we go uh, down again, we're going to save it again. All right. More shabby men attack us. Let's go ahead and advance the party. Attack. Attack. Okay, I'm not going to have Rainer do anything. Oh, jeez. Melthus went down just right off the bat. Needs to be some uh, attacking and melee uh, penalties in this game. Leather vest is broken. Okay, that's uh, on the enemies. All right, you are overloaded now. They just took Melthus out in one hit. Here, let's pour this down his gullet. do. Well, that is unfortunate, because uh, I do want him to get more experience points. But let's keep going, because we still have a lot of spell points left. As nasty as those fights were with the uh, Bandit 3s, I'd kind of like to get into another fight with one, because I think they had some better items. They did have gold. Not a whole lot. I can barely see what's going on on the screen. Get, get down. Thank you, jeez. Yeah, it, it, it's really part of the problem that the second that you're ever so slightly off-center, you're now no longer going straight. That I don't like. Bandit 2, Bandit 2, Bandit 1, Bandit 1. Attack. Use a small fireball. Use magic. Frost avalanche. Let's go. And he is down. And Melthus's spell did nothing because of that. Alright, use magic. Small fireball up there. You attack that one. You attack that one. Let's go. And Tom misses. With another small fireball, take him out. Okay. Advance party. Attack. Attack. Uh, we'll keep going with small fireball. At least until that's maxed out. And 
And down he goes. 90 experience points. Rainer can uh, still carry some more. Not anymore. Let's do that. You're getting overloaded now. That will probably be it. That's good enough. Uh, Sierra. 24 out of 29. Alright, Melthas. 21 out of 39. Okay, you can carry a little bit, but uh, we are pretty quickly uh, getting overloaded. Might actually be a good idea to go back. Let's go ahead and save. It's really loud sound effects. Let's actually turn those down. Set that to 40. Okay, we are out. Let's go ahead and rest. Rest till dawn. Get hit points and spell points back. Let's see how much the uh, the store guy buys some of these things for. So we have two price points already. Hello. Ah, you're, you're the lady who talks about the amulet. Got it. Hello. I would like to see what you have uh, for offer. All right, so protection amulet. I think we want to get that right now. Um, so that would be 800 if I buy both of them. I think we can afford that. I could get the dream shield right now. Let's actually check the uh, the sell points for some of these things. Okay, so he is gonna he would buy for the same price as um, the weapons merchant up to the north. I can't sell the broken leather vest. I do have to. Uh, Exam um, repair that first. Alright, well, we might get enough uh, selling what we've got to the north, so let's go ahead and start by buying the protection amulet. And we'll buy that. Go ahead and uh, put that on right now. So that gets him up to 28 defense, which is significantly more than Tom has. But I've taken off his shield, so that's a pretty good value. And the Monster Eye. Let's go ahead and buy that. I can't move that to someone else's inventory. So I've got 419 gold left over. Alright. It's been nice talking to you. And if I use this... 
activated. The monster eye has been activated. So now we have another thing over here. Should indicate to me when uh, monsters are getting close. Let's go ahead and make our way uh, to the north. I think I'll uh, head back through there off screen, sell stuff, come back down here, um, and just keep doing that uh, until uh, there don't appear to be any bandits left. Um, once that happens, I mean, I, I will buy the first the Dream Shield, if I can afford it, followed by the... Um, that sword, if I can afford it. Not sure if I can. Uh, but we'll see. But that will be next time. See you then, everyone.